morning. Today is Tuesday. The second video vlog today. I'm going to show you guys what I got responding to two curb alerts yesterday. Uh, I got some nice scrap metal at one curb alert, and I got some other household supplies um, at another curb alert. So I'm going to unpack the Subaru, show you what I picked up responding to two Craigslist curb alerts yesterday. I definitely got a bunch of scrap metal out of the. Uh, this first curb alert that I went to, uh, bucket and nails, a lot of scrap wire, a huge copper, a huge pipe, iron pipe, and there's actually a bandsaw in that, um, in there also. So I'm going to pull all that stuff out, I'll lay it out for you, so you can see about how much metal I got. Also, I'm going to lay out the household supplies, some records and some miscellaneous household glasses and goblets, things like that, but that are in the back. So I'll grab all that, I'll lay it all out for you so you can see exactly how well I did yesterday. Alright, so let's take a look here. Curb alert number two. Um, I got a large collection of records here. We got some old vintage records. Christmas drummer boy. Uh, I'm not sure if any of these are worth anything. Johnny Mathis, Ballet Melodies, most of these ones that are uh, kind of best ofs or seasonal are not worth much, but I could sell them as a lot, I could donate them, but I'm going to take a look, I'll look all these up, see if any of them are anything worth anything. In this box, same tag sale, a lot of miscellaneous, but again, brass. Anything metal I was grabbing, then I decided, let me just grab anything I can think I could resell. So I got some set of glasses and um, some of those uh, clay pots and a pasta maker. And, I mean, anything I thought I could make a little bit of money on, maybe I'm, I think I'm going to have a tag sale based on stuff I get for free. So I grabbed that. So tag sale, a Curb Alert 1, big pile of scrap metal. Let's test this, see if it's aluminum. It is. So again, aluminum. It's worth 50 cents a pound. Probably only three, four, five pounds here, you know, but hey, two bucks, three bucks at the scrapyard, not bad. Got some uh, steel. Got a bucket of nails, and I got this thing, had to take with a rock still attached to it. Hammer those off or just chuck it, who cares. Then I got this thing, table saw. So vintage like table saw, maybe put together, but not worth much in this state. Pretty sure I'm going to be taking a bigger hammer to it and smash it. Definitely going to cut that long cord off of it. That's worth 80 cents a pound. It might even be worth stripping it. So take this off. Um, the motor is worth something. So let's take bigger hammer to this thing and uh, get the metals out of that. So here's the load I'm taking to the scrapyard today. I got this steel filing cabinet picked up on the side of the road a while back, but I got a wood cabinet now. Uh, got rid of this rusty old thing. Got some scrap metal. Now this aluminum has nails in it, so I'm not going to bother pulling all those nails. It's only five pounds, and uh, I just don't really feel like it's worth my time to pull the nails to get another dollar. So um, some steel here. The only real parts off uh, that table saw worth scrapping was the poles and some of the nuts and bolts just not really worth my time here's the nice motor that I got off of that table saw 10 cents a pound maybe even worth something on eBay and uh, again just so we see the full load here's those co the huge iron pipe and the steel pipes um, that I have too so I'm gonna load up the subi take it down to my scrapyard and hey make 10 15 bucks today so stay tuned